I can't see any land here, Paula. Are you sure you're in the right place? Yeah, the X is right here. Look. Guess you'll never find a hidden penny remodel. Unless... Wait! Paula! I forgot this. And welcome to Broad Talk. Hello. It's a bit dark in here, Paula. It is, because it's the underwater summer. Oh, wow. But what does that mean? It's the deep sea brawl season coming to Brawl Stars, which is an underwater paintball arena and the home of a new brawler, Otis. Otis is a mysterious creature who lives in the depths of Star Park and expresses himself with his street art on any wall he sees. With his arm hose, he shoots four paintballs in a straight line and they mildly spread the further they go. For his super, he uses his starfish friend, Seal, who disables every ability your target has. While Seal is stuck to an enemy brawler, they can't attack, use gadgets or activate their super. However, they can still move and run for their lives. Otis is the chromatic brawler of the season, coming at tier 30 in the Brawl Pass and he becomes an Egyptian artist with his Pharaoh's skin at the last tier of the Brawl Pass. And for his first tier, you'll be getting Shark Tooth Cold. We have two more Deep Sea skins coming, Coral Bell and Octofang. For Power League, we'll have Postal Brawl, and coming in August, we'll release the Super Cell Make skin, shout out to Bouncy Duck, DJ3MC. We would like to announce our new partnership with BT21 and IPX, also known as Line Friends. BT21 are a new collection of characters designed by the worldwide famous stars of the K-pop band BTS. They are Edgar Tata, who has a very peculiar head shape. Ruff Chimi, no more badass, he's now an adorable coronal. Vivi RJ, who becomes super fluffy. Sandy Koya, both slip heads in one character. Jackie Cookie is a bouncy pink fellow full of energy. Boo Mang, instead of running, he will gallop. And Tik Shuki, he's now brown like a cookie. They will all be live on the same day in late July. Buying any skin will give you a free ping and unlock a purchasable spray and a profile picture. Something new for the people who love Wipeout and Showdown. We are now releasing a new game mode called Hunters, which is a 10 brawler arena with the same rules as Wipeout but in showdown maps. So the rules are pretty simple. Every time you get defeated, you respawn. And the first player to reach 10 takedowns wins the match. The placement will be decided by how many takedowns each player has when the match is over. Now, Danny, how do you like having to play Club League three times a week every week? Well... I know, nobody likes it. So now, we are giving everyone a week off. So we'll have one week for Club League and a week for Club Quests. Club Quests pop up every other week, so bi-weekly. And you have only one week to complete them. They are a lot easier and more casual than Club League matches. The more quests your club completes, the higher the reward everyone gets. And if you play with your clubmates, you can complete them faster. And we are also making a minor adjustment to the rewards. We are increasing the rewards you get in Club League weeks to compensate for the smaller rewards you will get in Club Quest weeks. Brawler Suggestion is coming to Power League. When suggesting a brawler, you'll be able to see all the brawlers your teammate has, so you can adjust your strategy based on the options. Suggestions from both of your teammates will appear on your own screen. Whether you decide to pick their suggestion is up to you. But maybe if both players suggest the same brawler, might be a good tip. We're also adding a new event slot that can have multiple maps, game modes and modifiers. It's a mystery mode. This won't be live every day, but the idea is to run multiple events with that where we can just press play and play something mysterious. There will be a small explanation on the I button for every time this slot pops up. Finally, she's here. Penny got a complete remodel not only to her appearance, but also on her gameplay. She still kept what makes her unique, the collateral attack and her treasure chest cannon. But now, her range is a bit shorter and the projectile speed got faster. 
She also got a gadget where she can drop a barrel on the map and can benefit from her collateral attack there. Her turret now signals where the bomb will drop, which will make it easier to dodge but will help her to maintain control. To make up for this, we are also adding the Balls of Fire star power to her basic kit. So whenever her cannon shoots, it will leave the area in flames for a while. You will find the full breakdown about her on the Brawl Content Creator channel soon. We asked you for challenge ideas and you've given us. So there will be a lot of challenges in this update and some of them will appear multiple times throughout the year. So if you miss it once, don't worry, you can still try again in a later date. Free stuff for the 10th anniversary of Heyday and Clash of Clans. A Heyday pin when the update goes out and a Clash of Clans event with a quest for a pin and a challenge for a spray. You will also get Barbarian Bull for free if you haven't got it before. Our sprays got their price reduced by a lot. Everyone who bought sprays in the current update will get the difference of chance back. The reimbursement will be available for free in the shop. The new prices for sprays are 19 gems for brawler sprays and 29 gems for general sprays which you can use with any brawler. Before we go, just one quick announcement. The Brawl Stars creators will be giving away Octofang skins. So search for hashtag Octofang giveaway here on YouTube or any other social media and read the rules to participate in the giveaways hosted by the Brawl content creators. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Give it a like, share it everywhere and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it yet. We'll see you at the end of August. Unless... Wait. Because <laughs> that was on my feet. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. Wait. What? Can we do it again? Wait. Oh, oh. And welcome to Roll Talk. Did I say something <coughs> wrong? Wait. <laughs> Don't die. <laughs> I said it wrong. <laughs> Just water. This is the underwater summer. <laughs> no! <laughs> it's okay. And Tik Shuki. He's now brown like a cookie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was the joke. Glad you guys liked it. <laughs>